what you saw last week is I see the games getting better. I see the rush getting better. I see the rush lanes getting better. I just see our team getting better. And I think you saw that last week with a lot of the four-man rush. I think you saw it when we started to pressure them when we could. And I just think you're going to continue to see that with those guys. And Levis goes down. We're like sending waves of different guys out there. So by the fourth quarter, when your line has played every single play and our D-line has each played half of those snaps, they're going. Now you got fast guys in the fourth quarter when they had to throw the ball. And that's why you saw, like, we were coming. Which is on, he's under pressure. He's hit, he's set, set for the eighth time. Another defense that's been getting home is Minnesota's. The Vikings lead the league in sacks, thanks in very large part to NFC Defensive Player of the Week, Jonathan Grenard, who's coming off a three sack performance. And Stroud is sacked. Jonathan Grenard. A sweet Sunday for Grenard, the former Texan. Not only is the scheme really tough to go against, but they've added some good pieces as well that have helped them become that much better. They pose a problem. They got smart players. They pressure a lot, and they're very talented across the board. So it's going to be a really big challenge for us this week. Takeaways will be at a premium in Sunday's border battle. And new Packers safety and league leader in interceptions, Xavier McKinney, is already up to speed on the significance of this matchup. It's a big game for us. It's a division game. You know, we know what we got to do, though. We know, you know, what this game means, you know, for, for us as a team, for our organization, for the fans. So we expect to play our best game, and that's just what it is. We're going to prepare that way, and uh, we're going to make sure that we're on point.